And one of the fancied nations, Ghana, of course, with a very pearly there, the veteran of your life. Three Africa Football of the Year accolades is by no means a fluke for any footballer to cap that with an African trophy, Champions League trophy, score 33 times in 73 appearances for your national team and win a number of league titles across the world must be the true mark of a true living football legend. In the years we have been saying, you a great defender, be a friend of we, or to me the standard we are, of what we are coming in. In the one day of our training, they threw through, uh, to his, uh, through to his work, or yet the airport, now you will say, or you a great player. Rising through the ranks are Colts Club, Great Falcons, Real Tabula United, Al Saad, and Marseille. Abedi Ayupele did not only display his great football artistry, and winning metal, but handed many young footballers huge lessons of determination from the very start. Abedi Pele was one of the first African football players to earn a top placing in the FIFA World Player of the Year voting in 1991 and 1992, won the France Football African Player of the Year award three times, and was the inaugural winner of the BBC African Sports Star of the Year in 1992. Abedi also won the Golden Ball Award for being the best player at the 1992 African Cup of Nations and was the man of the match in Marseille's historic UEFA Champions League final win over AC Milan in 1993. His successor as national team captain is best to extol Abedi's leadership qualities. I have to be honest, um, when I first joined the Blast Eyes, was, he was already the captain. You know, and as a leader of the team, you can't get any other better leader than him, you know, around my, I'm talking about my time, in terms of going to a, a very big match, you are a little bit worried, scared, when you look at him, you are motivated, you know, because of the kind of person he is, you look at his face, you know that he will, he will deliver. I quite remember um, in one of our tournaments, African tournaments, and any time he get, I get the ball to pass to him, there are like, there are like uh, three, four players around him. So I, I always don't give him, and he called it, give, me, give it to me, give it to me, you know. I just tried once, and how he managed to bypass these three guys around him was, was shocking. And so uh, you can clearly see the kind of person he is, and, and it's always fortunate for us to be a player alongside him. Abedi Pele was known for his speed, close control, drilling skills, as well as his passing and goal scoring ability. He usually played as an attacking midfielder or as a forward and earned the nicknames the Maestro and the African Maradona. His Black Stars teammate and close friend understood what it meant to play alongside the Maestro. Abidi Pele is one of the, the top notch players, technically gifted players that we have ever produced in the nation. And for me, in this generation, I must say he was one of the best. There's no name more befitting for the Living Legends Award. Tonight, Abedi Ayupele.